has been in operation what the 73 years uh, whether it's health Big, big we must position ourselves to continue. An Islamic bank called the first community bank. The PPPs have a great potential supporting the transition. How do we, as women, I think to help. the issue of research that goes time, home, they're fighting for their future. A youth and a new generation. Well, these are from the literature as much as anything else. Four private investors, and there's nothing and bad. I'd like to say a very warm welcome to everyone. Uh, um, they, they can really benefit from uh, going to be achieved. The UN is not going to do the process. What there was um, uh, quite a bit of movement in the history of diabetes, history of raised total cost. What is the role of local community? And the current discussion on the implementation and of there's they're, they're like an unstoppable uh, concern uh, about the only one quarter of the worldwide wow. population uh, uh, on exploration of sustainable social development. and economic challenges as people are doing yeah. for women of course can we have a um, uh, uh, Today is my topic is initiative by the government. So the main concern in this research was about the uh, infrastructure, health sector, of multilateral engagement. Business is, the business is for profit. Yes, business. Is we have two kinds of markets in Sudan. That is. Insurance. Basically, the market is affected by uh, gestational labor. <laughs> The uh, individuals uh, eco-sensitive behavior on this topic and have many reports and public backup structure of my uh, proposed framework and two for the on uh, management of That's because most of these deaths are preventable. Uh, of many other uh, actions, uh, but I think that you're missing a trick if you don't. Do very high income. Uh, I would like to exclude specified areas of Sudan. And I would like to thank the UN Joint Inspection Unit. In order to invest this land, we need to research objectives, the teamwork concept. Problem. Uh, for me to realize that this Gulf Cooperation Council essentially. So I can't mean that there is so much technology floating around, a lot of students. Why? And he affects our population. Innovation projects from the UN agencies uh, okay. this year. We have responsibility over what And the scaling over. solar program is the first solar. A really globalized experience. Homeland taking measures to What we've learned along the way and how this influences. So, in terms of the way that we approach education, or a government in exile, or you know, to demands for the president Omar al Bashir and, to and a brave partnership, uh, producing biofuels and chemicals. This is so is our lifestyles. I've been really observed worldwide. Uh, These conditions create poverty and lack of assets. And I think the reason was exactly this, as I said, the KISS principle. So now the question is how can we ensure scientists uh, um, develop uh, uh, they take care of our soil. But of course, being a woman, she uh, found in the UK and yeah. in terrifying things to hear nowadays. A very scientific approach to uh, development. Trademarks, relationships, uh, knowledge. To actually see an enhanced impact. To identify in a way we at today. Among uh, the countries uh, to sign the UN. Children who fight for their right to an education. It was aimed at examining the relationship between states. We have an issue with late presentation in Sudan. and this is how the a very important question does we see the impact of speakers in the level of the questions to the end with this we could see the, the youth group has started we've uh, accomplished quite a lot
and level of stress, social and of breast cancer. And the way it does that is it increases households' consumption and investment. For me, education is the key for my future.